Regency Court Storm Sewer Improvement, Site Work, Utilities, Concrete, RCS Construction. The Regency Court Storm Sewer Improvements Project posed several challenges from the start. The first challenge was to repair the slope with four beautiful existing homes above the work area. There were also key elements of work that must be coordinated. The water service to the home at 1120 Regency had to be relocated so that a Black Hills power transformer and streetlight, vast broadband and Golden West communications utilities could be relocated so that the 12 inch storm sewer could be replaced from the inlet on Regency Court between the two houses. Access to the site was between two houses on Wellington Drive. We had to build a road into the site for equipment and materials. There are over 8,000 cubic yards of material to be excavated, 1,000 cubic yards of topsoil to be imported, and 1,500 cubic yards of waste material had to be hauled off the site. There were also 1,500 tons of pipe bedding and structural rock brought to the site. Although the material had to be brought to the top of the slope with a loader or dumped at the top and placed with the loader. As soon as we began the repairs with a keyway at the bottom of the slope, the existing slope began to move. This was a very uneasy work environment. There was also an existing block wall that sank about two, two feet while we were constructing the slope repairs and revised scope of work was created by Long Branch. We worked closely with American Engineering Testing, Long Branch Engineering, and the City of Rapid to ensure that we proceeded safely and in, a, in the proper order. The slope repair called for a four, four foot deep by 20 foot wide keyway at the bottom of the slope followed by five foot by 10 foot steps cut into the slope across the width of the repair. Perforated pipes were installed across five of the steps and tied into a catch basin at the base of the slope. Rain drains from the existing houses and a perimeter drain around the repair area were also tied into a separate pipe and connected to the catch basin. After the slope was repaired and the perforated pipes were installed, a 12 inch storm drain from the street was brought down and tied into the catch basin at the bottom of the slope. After all of this work was completed, topsoil and compost were brought in and placed, followed by type two erosion control blanket and seating. Compaction was a cr critical component that took time and was closely monitored. The six successful completion of this project is due to the hard work by the RCS superintendent, Steve Schroeder, Perry Vandesteeg, Brandon Peel, and their crews. Close observation and coordination with Long Branch Engineering and the City of Rapid City. If you're traveling west on Highway 16, Catron Boulevard, you can see this project along the slope about a mile from the Mount Rushmore Road intersection. Master Craftsman, Project Manager, Derek Nicely. Superintendents, Steve Schroeder, Perry Vandesteek, Brandon Peel, Craftsman, Justin Larson, Roy Mack, Doug Hughes, Steve Patridge, Todd Sercala, Jeff Schumacher, Dan Miller, Bryson Priest, and Adam Neese. Help us congratulate the Craftsman from RCS Construction.